appreciate the unconditional love of the Canadians and the prophetic voice and action of the Canadian churches. Indeed, I can see the work of Kairos contextualized in what the prophet Isaiah says. Learn to do good, seek justice, correct oppression, bring justice to the fatherless, and please the widow's cause. Definitely, through our partnership, we are able to tackle justice on all levels. Besides the spirituality of justice, we are keen on bringing righteousness on the social, economic, and political levels. Through our joint work, we are also correcting injustice suffered, affirming the rights of the marginalized and oppressed, and bringing out the voices of and cries of the voiceless. Our Lord says, whatever you do for the least of my sisters and brothers, you are doing it for me. Your healing and steadfast love, your empathy and compassion strengthen us in every walk and talk. Your support and empowerment enhances our hope, casts out our fear and fights to build the resilience against the feeling of hopelessness and helplessness. We hope one day to give the world what is given to us so freely with credit. Today we are still at the receiving end. We want to launch our initiatives for the global partnership where we will be an active partner and not only recipients. What is left for us is to pray together. Our Almighty God, take away this heavy burden from us, whether it be annexation, land confiscation, or many of the other faces of injustice in Palestine and around the world. We ask you, our Lord, to help us in stopping any literal action of creating facts on the ground and any human rights violation whether based on nationality, race, religion, sex, gender, or other. Our Savior, please help us all lead lives of dignity and integrity.